what up guys, Woody from BF Zombies, and today I'm going to be doing a challenge slash live commentary orama as I get my seat ready so we can sit down and play. Okay, here we go. Shoot. Starting off a little Shangri-La, you know. Always some good shit going on. Um, but I'm also going to be talking about how I'm going to start doing a uh, challenge week. Um... I just thought this a few minutes ago, and I thought it was a really cool idea. What I'm going to be doing is, like, once a week, I'm going to be doing a uh, different challenge on any of the zombie maps, but I'm mostly going to be doing Shangri-La because it just came out. Sorry, I'm out of breath. I was just doing a lot of work outside of my house because 4th of July is a Sunday. So, alright, so here's what the challenge is going to be for um, this week. See how long you can survive in the main room without buying... Quick revive, really simple. And if you're not going to be versing me, you're going to be versing other people. The winner of this um, is going to be in my sub box, and I'm going to be doing like, uh, and I'll think of other shit to do with them or her, depending on what your gender is, of course. Where the fuck's this last zombie? Oh, here he is. There you go. All right. So yeah, we're going to see how long you can survive in this main room without buying Quick Revive, and you can't open any doors, you can get the Olympia, the M and the M14, and you can also use your pistol. That is great, right? Sounds like a good time. Um, but yeah, it'll be one of these things every fucking week, so we're going to have a jolly dildo in the ass time. Uh. So pissed off, too. If you guys watch my, um, the Easter egg steps... We got to the last part, and I was like, "What? How come we couldn't do it? How come we can't do this?" And I just realized I watched um, uh, Soji's video. Uh, I was on the Cod Express, I'm pretty sure, and it showed that I needed to get the um, dynamite that fell off from a uh, one of the crystals, which I completely forgot about. So now I might have to redo that last step and re-upload it, even though it took us so long originally to get it done. And yeah. Hope you guys also like the green screen stuff that I uploaded, um, last night. Uh, and yeah, so we're gonna start filming Kino sometime next week. And it's gonna be much better than the original test I uploaded last night. Some, like, one of them where I was just standing in front of the, uh, teleporter saying this is Kino. That wasn't that good. I'm not even fucking see this guy. I love doing that trick. Like, it, based on the rounds... Like, right now, that zombie I just killed was one shot with the M14, then I knifed him. And the next round is going to be two shots with the M14, and then you knife him. And then three shots, and four shots, and so fucking on. But hopefully I can get a little far in this. So what you're going to be doing is just seeing how long to survive in the main room. Um, record it. Put it as a video response. Um, you don't have to record the whole game. Um... But if you commentate on it, that'd be pretty cool, because maybe I can see if you want to do a dual commentary. Um, you can upload to the last round, but no glitching, even though I'm pretty sure there's no glitches in the main room to start off with. Not planning on going for it right now, I'm just trying to get a video up. I'm trying to upload videos daily now. I feel like there's zombies everywhere around me, but I can't see them. I want to see if I can do this. Apparently you can get a perk drop. Damn it. You get a good amount of points for knifing those zombies, for knifing the monkeys. I'm pretty sure you get like 500 points. It's pretty cool. I just found out, did you know that um, the monkeys can actually drop perk bottles, which I thought was pretty sweet. So, try to knife his not. Next time you see a monkey take a perk, try to watch out and maybe if you see a perk bottle, knife it and you can get a nice perk free perk out of that just watch it on the syndicate channel so something cool oh that's right i just got a hammer all the windows are boarded up nice nice boop boop do 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 um i'm not gonna be uploading a lot of videos this week because i have family coming in from uh that that live far away oh shit shrieker
Thank God, I fucking killed that guy. Shit, I'm running really low on ammo. Alright, there we go. So yeah, I have family coming in, and I'm not going to be really playing Xbox a lot. I'm going to be hanging out with them. Probably going to die right here. Okay, that was tremendous. Max ammo. This is getting kind of hard. It's only round four. Oh shit, fucking monkey dick. Alright. And also, um, if you guys haven't seen already, if you're not subscribed to Syndicate, he's doing a, uh, kind of like a challenge where it's similar to this. You need to see how long you could stay in the main room, but it's not basically based on rounds. It's how many points you can get with another person. T together, they got around 29,000 points by round eight without opening any other doors, which is honestly ridiculous. But once again, he also got, like, a shitload of times twos, like a couple nukes, and a lot of insta-kills. So, like... It's going to be really hard to do, but if you're up for the challenge, check that out. Just grab a, grab a partner and just record it and submit it as a video response to his channel. And it's basically kind of what you're going to be doing with this video. Um, I tried to do some of these on Ascension. Didn't get a lot of, didn't really get a response. But hopefully now um, that people are really interested in Shangri-La, that they'll start um, checking out other videos, all that kind of shit. And we'll have a good old time. Okay, let's see how... Far, you know, I'm on round five. That that if that last round Oh my god, this is gonna be intense. Let's put it that way. It's gonna be so intense. I'm gonna be sweating in a couple seconds. I reload quicker. Shit. Fuck, Flamer. Shit, this does not look good, guys. Oh! Alright, well, I got to round five. Um, but if you guys can get further, um, it's going to be based on the highest person. And I'm not going to be giving away a prize if there's only, like, one submission. I want to get at least five, maybe six. But if there's only one submission out there... Um, there's not going to be really a prize. I just want to keep, I want to get the community active in the zombies, and I want it to be a fun time. So, stay tuned, please like, comment, subscribe, and submit your video.